All right, so what you guys are watching is some exclusive footage from an alleged shooting that happened at Young M.A.'s concert a few days ago in Kansas City. You know what I'm saying? It got real, real crazy up there out of nowhere. You know what I mean? You see Young M.A. right there on the stage. A few minutes later, all of a sudden, you hear gunshots and this guy holding the camera. He ducks for his life. All right, you guys, I'm going to play the entire video with the audio so you guys can hear it. And then I'm going to come back with more commentary. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. This is the DJ Jericho Pop. Podcast where you talk about celebrity news and commentary. Now let's get into this video. Now, y'all see that, man. Straight up chaos, okay? Like I had said before, uh, you see the rapper Young M.A. standing on the stage. It looked like she's greeting fans, you know what I'm saying? Like it's an intermission, you know? And then the guy with the camera, you know, he's just coasting around. And next thing you know, you hear pop, 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 shoot, shoot, bang, bang up in the club. You know what I mean? And it's just like, for me... You know, this is just getting out of control when it comes to the gun violence and the shootings that's happening around these rappers. It just seemed like the social norm at this point. It's not even safe to even want to have a rap career at this point. You know what I'm saying? Every time I look up, every time I look down, there's a rapper being shot, there's a rapper being killed. There's somebody getting shot or killed or attempted to be killed out in the middle of these streets when it comes to being a rapper. It's just not safe, man. And, you know, luckily, Young M.A. was not shot. You know, I haven't heard any reports at this time of anybody being injured from that incident. It. but you know what i mean it's just a thing where it's time for hip-hop artists to really sit down and have a summit and have a discussion about all this violence that's going on you know what i mean we just had um i mean we, i mean the list of, of rappers that has died in in this year alone you know is enough to fill out an entire encyclopedia at this point and i'm not understanding you know why it seems like the violence is so bad you know i feel like um in the hip-hop cu culture gun violence has been so glorified that we're at the point at at the very worst that it has been in the past i don't know 20 or 30 years since we lost tupac and biggie you feel me so you know i i'm just like at the point where i'm just like nah i'm good on a rap concert i don't even want to go to no rap concerts you know is it even safe to even be a rapper to go on stage you know what i mean and perform because you don't know if you're going to make it home you know at this point being a rapper is equivalent to just being you know just being in the gang life you know what i'm saying you still getting the same results a lot of these rappers are getting locked up thrown in jail still a lot of these rappers are out here getting shot and killed just trying to do the things that they love to do you know it's just like at this point and on top of that you know, we even got females out here that's MCs getting shot and killed, you know. Um, you know, it's so many. And I really don't even like re reporting death on my page, by the way. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. This is the DJ Jerrica Podcast where we talk about celebrity news, commentary, and gossip. Okay, just telling you guys to make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, check out my full podcast available now on Apple Podcasts, Spotify for my full hour-long show. I got new videos dropping soon, but let's back to the conversation. There's so many people out here, rappers being killed, shot and killed, men and women, and it's just like, when is the violence going to stop? Like, seriously, when is the violence going to stop? You know, I, I really don't know what needs to be done. I don't know if it needs to be a hip-hop conference meeting. I don't know. But at this point, if my child ever came out to me, and I'm not even a parent or any any of my nieces and nephews came up to me and said, yo, I want to be a rapper, I would be like, no, you're not doing it. Because honestly, it just seemed like it's open season on rappers out here. And I know sometimes when it comes to being a rapper, you're in the streets still. A lot of those rappers still haven't let go in the street life, and that ended up being the end results. But just the violence in general um, when it comes to the black community and gang lifestyle and stuff like that, it's, it's a big problem. It's really a big problem. So, you know, hopefully, you know, we don't hear any more shootings. I already know that we will because it seems like every day I wake up and I see the news, there's another uh, dead relatively unknown rapper or a semi-popular local rapper in a different state that's been shot and killed whether it's because somebody's trying to rob them, jealousy, envy, it's just ridiculous. And I'm so tired of seeing in the media how we have artists like Pop Smoke 
you know, out here being post homage and they're put working on album number two. And unfortunately he's not here to see it because of the, the mindset of these people out here, mindset of these young black folks out here that are jealous to see another person be successful and use their talent and, you know, and make it in life. You know what I'm saying? So it's just, it's a lot. Um, I don't want to make this video too long because like I said before, these are short videos. If you guys want to hear more about it, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, notification bell, and make sure you follow me on Spotify. Apple Podcasts and much, much more for my extended show, which is usually about an hour, sometimes two hours, depending on how I feel. I'm working on episode 57 this week, and I can't wait for you guys to hear it. But anyways, y'all comment below. Y'all tell me what y'all think about the whole situation. Anybody got details that may have been at the event, you got details or information, feel free to comment below. I want to know more about what you're talking about, and we're going to talk about it um, on the show. So I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. Much love. Peace.